A school team orders t-shirts and half zips. Jill, Mike, Ted and Gary order t-shirts. Jill and Alice order half zips. Ben and Zena don't order either. Complete the Venn diagram below to show this information where U is the whole team, the universal set. T is the set of people ordering t-shirts. Z is the people ordering half zips. Well, it's useful for us to find is there anybody who's ordered both a t-shirt and a half zip. And Jill is in both lists. So she's in the intersection here. So I'm going to put Jill in first here. So Jill is in the list that goes in the middle of T and Z. Uh, Mike, Ted and Gary only order t-shirts. So we have Mike here already, but I'm going to add in Ted and Gary. Um, and Alice orders a half zip, but not a t-shirt. Ben and Zena are on the outside. They're not inside the circles. They are part of the group, but here. So in total, how many students are there on the team? Well, we just count them up. There's Mike, Ted, Gary, that's three, Jill, Alice, Ben and Zena. It gives a total of seven. Write each term from the following list in the correct space in the table below to match each description to the correct term in set notation. Okay, one well, students who order both t-shirts and half zips. If you order both, that's the intersection. So that'll be this answer here. This is the intersection. This will be T intersection Z. Students who order half zips but not t-shirts, that would be this answer here. Zips but not t-shirts is Z not T. Or Z less T. Students who don't order half zips. There's only one choice left, but we can see that it's the correct answer. This the complement of Z means uh, not said.